Hi, I'm Lisa Will and I'm from Hunter Garrison. And I'm Nathan Appleton from Munster. We're two of this year's delegates from the BFG Youth Forum. And we, this week we've been concentrating on some of the things which matter most to young people. Bullying is a big problem in Germany and we know that it does happen. So we want to make the young people more aware of what to do if they are bullied or know someone who's been picked on. Not a lot of people in BFG know there's a problem. It's when you're walking around school you see people getting bullied, but no one ever does anything about it. And I think the resources we can use is people's self-confidence. And if we can get people to join in to stop bullying, then, then we will have resources to stop it. Bullying in Germany can sometimes make things more complicated. Young people in... The UK can get lots of funding for projects to make their lives better. But we're unable to access that money because we don't live in the British Isles. We think this is unfair. So we are launching a campaign to change the rules and get us included. I think that many of the people in BFG feel that um, they're being restricted from a lot of stuff, which um, actually is the case. So things like college funds and also the school curriculum, they feel that they're being um, restricted from those, so they feel that they should um, have more choice and more variety in those matters. And once you turn 16, there's not much for you to do here. If you want a job, there's not much choice unless you want to work for NAFI. What happens to young people who cannot find the right options for them in BFJ? They either have to go to England to board, or their family moves back to England to board, or they stay with someone, a relative, or they stop education and join the NAFI. The BFG Youth Forum has been running for four years now, and in that time we've managed to have a say in how the military community looks after the young people. We've also managed to secure a new youth opportunities fund, which gives each garrison €5,000 to spend on what it wants. But why is having a youth forum so important? Well, here's what some of this year's delegates think. Young people in VFG have a right to say what they feel and have equal rights as many adults do in the VFG areas. In military life, things are very fixed, and if kids don't have their say in what they want, nothing's going to be done. The people who we're trying to get the point across to, they don't really see what we see and they don't experience what we experience, and they're kind of blind to it, so we need someone to stand up and tell them what's going on. On the last day of the conference, we presented our ideas to some of the decision makers in BFG. We wanted to ask them what they can do for us. I think the, the main influence is to be able to identify what our needs are and then to identify whether we've got the funding already over here or whether in fact we need to go back to the UK and that could be to the MOD and ask them for the funding or in fact as we are currently doing we're going into other parts of the uh, government such as the Learning and Skills Council and we're trying to get funding from them and normally they wouldn't provide funding overseas but we've won a case where we've proved that actually our children, young people and children over here, should get that sort of funding. What effective policies and procedures around bullying are in place around BFG? Well, there are policies in place, and SCE have a, a policy which uh, runs across the schools, uh, which is supposed to be uniform and applied equally among the schools. But uh, I su suspect, in, in terms of your question, uh, is that policy effective? Well, perhaps I should turn that around and say, well, you know, is, is this a problem that uh, you, the Youth Forum, uh, think is a, an issue within schools? And clearly the fact it's being raised and discussed at this forum uh, might imply that it is. So it's something we need to look at. The BFG Youth Forum has already proven it can play an important part in the decision-making process. Now it's up to the people in power to make our ideas happen. This is Lisa Will and Nathan Appleton for BFBS reports at Youth Forum in Gillingham.